everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Natalie Mayhew and I'm a songwriter and music educator in Seattle. Today I'm going to be playing Heirloom, the song that I wrote for the December themed songwriting challenge. I went off theme this month for the first time ever. I wrote it all in one sitting on the day of the meeting, so the song is exactly a week old today. I hope you enjoy it and I will be back to talk about it a little bit more after. He passed it on to him, he passed it on to me, I passed it on to you. You something close and profound from a far away town comes back around like. Something stays She passed it on to him Waited until when He was found again He traced it back to her Traced it back The good things stay Something close and profound From a far away town Comes back around Renewed, refurbished, remade Maybe showing its say but the good things remain. And now for a segment I like to call Produce or Cut It Loose. One of the reasons I would produce this song is because I personally ended up really liking it. I put a lot of heart and soul into it. I've been researching my own family history and I've also been watching a show called Repair Shop on Netflix, which I hi highly recommend. Everybody around me is really sick of me talking about it, but um, that was partially where the idea of heirloom came from, was about objects, but also about people and that we all come from many generations of people. Reasons to cut it loose, I got some very mixed feedback from my songwriting group about it. Um, one person said that they thought it might be about COVID, which I totally understand because COVID is on our mind every single day, all the time. However, there were also some other remarks made at the songwriting circle that it could be about other types of diseases, which I was not expecting and it kind of disappointed me. But if I were to play the song, perform it, for people, they may have the same thoughts. I don't know. If one person had the thought, then someone else surely will tell me, tell me that again. But I think that I ended up really liking this song, so it's very likely that I am going to produce it. 
moving on to something totally different. I made it to my 50 subscribers recently. Thank you so much. And so I'm going to reveal my pet. Meet Boris, the Russian tortoise. I call him my stepson because my husband got Boris while he was in middle school. We think Boris is between 16 and 19 years old. Here's Boris eating a bell pepper, which is one of his favorites. He lives in an enclosure with bark in it, but we try to take him on walks so he can stretch his legs when the weather's nice. Russian tortoises can live up to 50 years, so even though they're pretty low maintenance, they are also a really big commitment. Please comment below if you have any thoughts about anything in this video. I love reading your comments, and I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.